Yo, what up everyone? I'm here, your owner, Rappin' and Snacking, getting into another product showcase. This is going to be on Black Thought's new release with L. Michaels, Mitchells, Mikkel's affair. I've never known how to say their names, so pardon my ignorance. Hit me up on Instagram and TikTok at Rappin' and Snacking. So here I got the newest Black Thought release, and I got it on all formats. It was actually pretty cheap. I'll go ahead and show you the price that I got them for. Um, <clears throat> the cassette... $10, CD, $10.99, and colored vinyl, $20.99. You know, these are for a total after shipping and tax of $47. For all three formats, you know, you won't find deals like that really anymore, which is a shame because um, now what you'll see is a lot of records just selling alone for $40 a pop, even sometimes $50 a pop, depending on who's selling it or what it is. So it's pretty annoying, but at least with this release, that's how it is. They also Throw in a sticker. So anyways, let's go ahead and show you all everything. First, I'm gonna go ahead and start off with the cassette tape right here. Boom. So this is a limited edition cassette, as you would assume, because just most cassette uh, pressings are that are released these days. So we got right here, Glorious Game. Pretty cool cover art and um, colorway, in my opinion. I really like that that turquoise-ish, bluish green, whatever you want to call it, boom, boom, boom. Glorious game. And then still got the sticker on here. This one's still sealed. I'm going to keep this cassette sealed. You got the white cassette tape. You can go ahead and see um, the screws in it and all that. Uh, very neat font for you to make it. Uh, make sure you can read that real easy, boom, boom, boom. And then there's a track list. There you have it. Now moving on to the CD. As you notice, this cassette tape did not have a hype sticker or anything on it. it just didn't come with one it just had the um, barcode right there the cd does have a sticker a uh, hype sticker i took it off i preserved it and it's slightly different than the one on the vinyl which i'll show you can see here features the hits that's what it says and then once again the group name and then big crown and the catalog number and moving on to the cd we have a digi pack so boom right there we got the spine, and then we got the back. So right here, we have some artwork on the back. Um, and then, boom. So 12 tracks right there. Open it up. There's no booklet or anything like that, but you do have some credits right here. So pretty cool stuff. Here's the CD artwork. And then let's go ahead and see if there's anything underneath. That's eh, just plain. So nothing too crazy, nothing that will blow your mind, but there you have it. Now moving on to the vinyl. Same cover, obviously, and uh, I opened it already, so you can go and check it out. The uh, sticker is different here. Limited edition indie retail exclusive pressing. Once again, I did buy this on Big Crown's website, so I didn't buy it from a third-party website. Glorious game, and it says sky-high colored vinyl, and then boom. The back right here, very similar to the CD. You got, you know, some credits right here. Who's doing what, what instruments, who's doing vocals, etc. Track list, you see me in the cut right there with my Lakers gear on. Uh, you see right there the um, side A and side B. And shout out to the Dodgers right here, boom, boom. And then right here, we have more. More of the production. So then moving on, we have the actual vinyl itself. Nothing else is in there. Um, vinyl, just a white paper sleeve. And then we're going to go ahead and get to the sky colored vinyl. That is actually, <laughs> I would define that as like a, like kind of like a bluish sky for sure. So that's a pretty neat, I don't really have a vinyl this color. Um, and you know, I'm not anyone who's been following this channel for a while. I don't care about colored vinyl. I mean, I just prefer if it was black. But at least this isn't like something that's that you see every day, I guess, right? Um, and then, boom, just simple, one vinyl, six tracks on one side, and then six tracks on the other side. I love when they put the um, song names on the actual label so I don't have to refer to anything else. It's just right there. You know, I think they did a, a good job with this considering it's fairly cheap, and you can get all formats for under 50 bucks unless you live, maybe if you live out of uh, the U.S., maybe the shipping will get you there, but... Aside from that, uh, it's pretty good bang for buck. Also, on top of that, too, I did check their website before making this video. It looks like their website still does have the vinyl. 
also has the cassette tape, which is odd, is it doesn't have the CD for sale. It says it's out of stock, which is funny because vinyl and tape are advertised as limited edition pieces, but I'm sure you can find the CD anywhere. I'm sure the tape and vinyl will be tougher to find uh, elsewhere as the years go on, but I know there are also different colored uh, vinyl and just vinyl in general for this release. Anyways, I'm very excited to listen to this. Got back from vacation just earlier in the week, so I'm gonna peep that out. If you have any thoughts on the album, go ahead and let me know. If you know how to pronounce El, Mikael's, Mitchell's, Michael's, Affair, whatever, let me know down below. I probably should have looked it up before, but who cares, you're doing it off the dome. Appreciate y'all. Instagram, TikTok, wrapping and snack, and talk to y'all next time. Bless up.